So now let's see how we can utilize the Glotify effect inside of GIMP. So in order to utilize the Glotify effect, first of all, you need to go around onto the filters menu right here, and then you need to go around under Artistic. And over here, you can see that Glotify is an option. So once you go around on to Glotify, you can go around and set the blur levels on the X and Y axis according to how you want and change around the parameters according to how you want and change the depth level of the cloth that you want right here. So once you're happy with the parameters, you can simply go around and then press OK right here. And what happens is that it, um, um, it, it simulates out clothing right here, just like this. And as if it is, uh, as if the image is being printed on a piece of cloth. And that is how you can simply uh, utilize the Glothify effect right here. There is no preview right here. So let me just press Ctrl Z right here. And over here, if you want to change out the levels, you can go around and change around the blur level right here. And and work around with the depth as you can see right here and if you were to go around and press ok then that level of effect will be applied over here just like this so that is how you can work around with the clothify filter inside of gimp so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe <laughs>